All right, how's it going, Instacart shoppers? Today we're hitting up the Wells Fargo drop. Just kidding, we're at Costco. The good news is Costco had a pretty good drop today. They had uh, actual orders pop up on the screen around the normal time, so we will call that a success. I ended up taking a $48 order. Didn't even like really get to look at it. It's two people and 47 items at Costco. That is a lot of shopping too. So wish me luck. I'm gonna go do this order and um, I'll meet you guys back out here. Yeah, today's just gonna be another boring ride along because I, I don't have any video ideas right now. Or I do, but I'm just like, I'm recording so much in advance, it just doesn't make sense. All right, easy order. It wasn't that easy, I'm lying. It took me an hour to shop. I did uh, meet this one lady named uh, Arlene, shout out to you. She may have just convinced me to start doing Amazon Flux and Instacart because she's making a lot more than me stupid money so we're gonna be looking into that let's pack up this big order wonder why I use two carts and not a flatbed all the time and when there's a lot of little stuff I prefer doing two carts because it makes it easier for the cashier not to mix things up I've had cashiers mix things up with the flatbed before which is why I'm always cautious I've gotten an email from Instacart before because of this problem so I just have to be as cautious as possible now which is why I do two carts so if you're ever wondering the more you know all right, first drop off, 10 minutes away. I think the next drop off will be like 10 to 15 too. So see you on my next order. All right, so we just took a $25 10 mile order at Costco, of course. The last order ended up taking me almost two hours, which isn't the greatest, but we still ended up making around $46 because we had to do a few refunds. Not too worried about it. With this order, we should be right around 60 to 65. <laughs> We shopped that in probably around 15 minutes. It was really easy. One replacement, everything else was in stock. One Karen. But we're gonna pretend like she didn't happen and just try and keep enjoying our day. First drop off is 12 minutes away. So I'm gonna write my thank you notes and I'll be on my way. So we're at $75. We just took an HEV order and it was actually only 20 items, five miles, $28. So really sweet deal and we should get some fuel assistance because it's actually like a normal grocery store. We'll cross our fingers on that one. It's been a great day so far. So many lovely drivers and just angry Karens in the store. I, I don't get it. Why? <laughs> I saw something kind of weird today and um, I don't know if I should be mentioning this or not, but I, I could be like super ignorant here, but there is this Instacart shopper that has been using handicap spots. She has a handicap sticker and all that, and this girl looks healthier than me, so obviously there could be some stuff going on that I can't see, and that's why I could be really ignorant here, but this girl looks like she is perfectly fine getting that close parking spot for Costco orders. And it's just like, it bothers me because I see a bunch of these old ladies at our Costco that have to walk a super long distance because of people using those spots that are healthy and not 80 to 90 years old. Yeah, kind of weird, right? All right guys, so it's been a little, I forgot to record an outro for this video. So like three days later, here we are. Let's talk about that day that happened a while ago now. So we made a total of $136. We only worked six hours, which puts us right around 22 an hour. If you wanna subtract like gas money, we're gonna be a little closer to 21. I drive a Civic, so it's not that bad, trust me. So yeah, overall, nice little day. We didn't make too much money, but we also didn't work that much to begin with. So uh, yeah, no complaining there.
Also real fast, before you guys leave this video, my wife that has been in several of my YouTube videos, she's making her own Instacart slash gig YouTube channel. So make sure you guys check her out. I will have a link down below and I'll probably pin her comment as well. She's gonna be uploading similar content to myself. And I know that there's some ladies here that already really enjoy watching her in my videos. So I think you guys are gonna enjoy her channel. She's super excited to get to know you guys and start her own community. So yeah, with that being said, I'll see you guys on the next video.